Wilson. Wilson. At last, we saw a relaxed Jockey Wilson tonight. You played a lot better, John. Well, Peter, I thought I had to because I'm playing big Lazarenko. And Cliff's a good friend of mine. We have a drink together all the time. And Cliff's been playing reasonably well in the championship up to now, and I've been playing terrible. But I felt with it being seven sets, it gave me time to relax, you know, tonight. But we were dodgy on our doubles, I thought. I thought you both were bad on doubles, Sam. I mean, the scoring was incredibly high. Well, but the, the actual well, checking out was poor. Well, I think the crowd was really brilliant till we came to a double, and then I think the nerves got the better of Cliff and myself. But that starts, I mean, if we'd went out, I think we'd have had the best average of the tournament up to date if we did it tonight, but we didn't go out, so... But I'm very relieved, man, getting through a hard match like Mr Lazarino. How conscious were you of the fact that you were two darts away from a £32,000 uh, payday for a nine-darter? Well, I missed it last year. I was gutted this time. But I rushed the, the treble 15, I yeah. think. Wilson! He's done a tender. Thank you. He's got it. Oh, treble 15 he needed. 135. Well, next round, semi-final, I don't think you can have expected in your wildest dreams that uh, you'd have been up against uh, young Keith Della. Well, to tell you the truth, no disrespect to John, because I've always said John is the most consistent player in the world, and I'll still say that, yeah, even though young Keith beat him tonight, uh, Peter. But I think, uh, personally, he's been playing brilliant all week, He's been up, getting up his breakfast, practicing seven hours, I'm telling you, every day prior to his games when he's playing. Even you were practicing with him today, weren't yeah, you? Yeah, I practiced yeah. with Keith all week, even when he's not playing, when he's a day off. He's been playing, he's really been playing marvellous, and I think he's the player of the championship. Well, he's certainly been the sensation of it, certainly uh, removing well, the, the number two seed, but how confident is the number three seed, I wonder? Well, <laughs> I, I never, I never, I'm not an Eric Bristol, I don't shit with my thought. I've been playing bad. I played well tonight, I thought, apart from missing my doubles. But I'm very happy with my form tonight. Yeah, well, it was and a very Keith, convincing win tonight. And Keith is a great friend of mine, but I still want to win. I'm sure I don't you want do. to lose to Keith, but it'll be a hard game. I've well, got to try. I look forward to it. Very best of luck, John. Thanks very much, Peter. Yeah, it certainly was a terrific match there. And of course, as you'll have gathered from that, uh, young Keith Della did actually beat John Lowe in their other quarterfinal match, which was played here this evening. In our earlier pro